I mentioned before, um, both fighters last fought under the Rebel FC banner in August and um, Shafiq won that night but Silvio lost. So it'd be interesting to see if both fighters paid attention to the strengths and weaknesses during that, um, during that, in, during that night. But um, it's Silvio tries to go for an early takedown. Shafiq, of course, a very accomplished striker. Yeah, he's had some boxing matches that I've, I've seen that are fantastic. Not, to man, not forgetting to mention, he's also um, the only Singaporean to win an Asian Muay Thai championship. So. Again, he, he, a lot of heart on that kid too, man. That, that kid's got heart for days. Silvio, I've never seen him fight before, but I've seen Safiq fight before. And uh, again, he, he, he fought for me a while ago. And uh, yeah, I mean, again, tremendous heart on this kid. I know that he's had some, some thoughts about whether or not he wants to stay with the sport. But it's his passion. Very nice kicks from Shafiq. Shafiq landed three consecutive kicks. But Silvio shot for the takedown and he gets it. Well, Silvio, Silvio's got uh, Cristiano in his corner. Cristiano Camichi, and again, a, a very accomplished. Uh, Camichi, of course, yeah. Former Heat champion, 1FC fighter. Yep. Lost to McSweeney by way of uh, soccer kicks, but you know. Losing to, lose yeah, <laughs> losing to Max Sweeney isn't, isn't really a I'd bad be thing. I'd with that loss. I'd be okay with that loss. Uh, you can see, again, Silvio, he, I think he wants to be on the ground. I think he wants to keep us on the ground. But he's not, he's not changing formation. And you can see that uh, Safiq's getting his, his butt out. He's scooting out as, as much as he needs to. And he gets it back. Very nice escape from Shafiq Samad, who's, of course, a blue belt in BJJ. I'm not too sure about Silvio, though. Again, look at Safiq. Again, the, the difference between the pros and the Amis. Look, look at his hands. Safiq's hands are always up. He's got his elbows going. He's not. He, he's not. He's Let not me. putting stress on his shoulders. He's not freaking out. He's just letting them hang down. Whereas again, Romero laying real, real low with the hands. Those are not the type of shots that are going to land for. Well, Rome, well, to me, I think Romero is looking really uncertain about his strikes. And he's trying to rely on getting takedowns. What's funny about the fight game is, again, when you go in there with a game plan or you go in there with an uber amount of confidence and it gets shut down in the first couple, couple moments of the fight, you, 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 there's no plan B. There's no plan B. You know, I, I, Romero goes, goes onto the canvas. To go to his back right there. I think his leg is hurting. I think he's ate quite a lot of hard kicks from Shafiq and his leg is hurting. And Romero is now down on the canvas, Shafiq in sight control. Will the kill chop in his corner calling for short elbow. Got the knee up on the gut right now, he's knee on belly. And uh, yeah. He's looking to go to a mount? I would believe that he's looking to go to the mount when he, when he can. There he goes. And he does it. Shafiq the slasher mounts Silvio and now Silvio gives out his back. In a total position now. He hasn't sunk in the hooks yet, so going for that rear naked is not the smartest thing to do when you don't have the hooks in. Uh, he's content to go to the side. What, what's funny is again, if we were going unit, if we were going like a global rule set, now is where you would stand up and kick him in the head. Shafiq now finds himself in side control. Great job by Silvio to escape that turtle position earlier on, but he's still in big trouble. Shafiq lands some hard shots. All, all fights, um, all of Shafiq's fights have ended in stoppages. A very nice kick. But the referee is warning Shafiq that there's no soccer kicks think, allowed. I don't think it was a soccer kick. I don't think he was actually throwing a soccer kick. Well, it was accidental. Bring him up. Um, what we'd like to see is more of the combinations. He came in with that knee right there. That was good. But we didn't see the combinations right there. We saw, saw the one punches. Again, Ramirez throwing just the one punch. That's not going to do anything against what, what the slasher has to put out. Well, he's, right, he's relying a lot on his hooks, and he's not just throwing those hooks. He's, he's basically throwing some winging hooks. He just wants to get as much power as he can on those hooks and hope that that one shot connects and knocks Shafiq out. You know what's awesome about this fight so far is although Shafiq has been very dominant, we probably are going to the round two. And we'll get to see what they have to do in terms of uh, their cardio, in terms of their game plan, in terms of what they want to do in the further rounds. Because right now, Romero is falling on the ground, and that's falling on the that ground was, for yeah, a reason. That was a push by Shafiq. But, 
Well, let's see what Silvio comes out with uh, in the second round. Definitely took a beating in the first. Um, lands a nice left hook. Shafiq pushing the pace. His eyes are. Look at how wide Shafiq's eyes are. He, he, he's got his hands up, but he's still, again, he's got his jaw down. He's doing everything he can. And, and I, again, the boxing skills are actually coming into play. The head movement right. is fantastic. Yeah. But I think that's the mark of a boxer, not to ever put your hands down. Correct. Correct. I mean, again, and, that, and that's classic Western boxing, not Muay Thai. Um, and, you know, and Romero's coming with those those, those haymakers, but, but do those actually, you know, look at him, he's going head down, he's trying for that drive, but without the cage, also without the cage right yeah. there, where is he going to drive him into? Exactly. But if Romero wants oh, a takedown, if Romero wants a takedown, he needs to get it in a clean way. And... Again, he's he wants to fight. He wants to fight to take place on the, on the canvas. Yes! And Shafiq doesn't want any of that. He wants this fight to take place on the feet. Shafiq clearly dominating the striking exchanges. Straight right connects. Uh, his corner is yelling out to take those uh, uppercuts. And, and that, uh, either the uppercut or the knee. Either one. Uh, Safiq seems very, very, he's got that liver shot. He ate that liver shot and Romero's a big, it's a big trouble. The referee's right on top of that. It was a liver shot, it was a liver shot by Shafiq which connected and Romero's struggling where he's definitely hurt. And I think Shafiq can smell blood right now. Oh, he's a shark in the water right now. And there is chum, there is plenty of chum. And that chum, again, I, I hate to say it, but Romero right now. I mean, he's accepting the shots to the face, but he's not. He's like, he's covering up in a way where he doesn't even see what else is coming. I mean, there's a way to cover up and there's a way to not. One is defense, and one is you're gonna about to get kicked in the in the head. He goes back to the lane. He goes back onto the canvas. Clearly, the fans are not happy with what Silvio's doing right now. But can you blame him? Well, I can't blame him. Again, I don't want to get hit in the, in the face or the liver the way that uh, he's accepting punishment. But if, but, but if he gets hit like that and he falls... But I think, John, is there a possibility that the ref's going to come in and stop the fight because the of what... Stop the, fight. the referee will stop the fight if he can't get up. If he can't get up, if he can't get up, that fight is over. Well, well Shafiq's corner is livid because of what um, Silvia's doing right I now. Again, I, let the, I let the referees do their job. You gotta let the referees do their job. You gotta let the referees do their job. Well, Silvio is doing a really good job at time wasting, but Shafiq, relentless with that pressure. Again, Shafiq, super content to make it a striking match. Obviously, remember, oh, and another body That's an uppercut. Body. And that's it. Shafiq with another knockout to his name. Just a one-sided beatdown on Silvio Romero. Who tried to resort to some um, tactics which uh, pretty much weren't favoured by the crowd. Obviously, you know, just going to the ground and hoping that the ref will stand up and um, ensuring that that wastes some time. But Shafiq was having none of that. That uppercut connected straight on his face and that was good night, Irene. I think he made the right decision in stopping the fight because Romero didn't seem content in wanting to um, strike with um, Shafiq at all. And each time Shafiq landed a hard shot, Romero just went straight to the ground. So I reckon it's a good stoppage by the referee. Good intervention, sorry.